Hi friends, it is with great pleasure that I will present to you an almost complete series of the Beethoven piano sonatas performed by the great pianist Walter Gieseking. Walter Gieseking is mainly recognized for his rendition of Mozart, Debussy and Ravel. However, he was known to perform the Beethoven 32 piano sonatas already by heart at the age of 17. The present recording date from 1949 to 1950. Gissi King was at that time over 50 years old. He had become very skillful to performing Beethoven's sonatas. I would like to emphasize an important point here. The audible technical imperfection are due to the age of these recordings, which don't correspond to today's standards of digital transcription. For some, they are true of charm with a true stamp of authenticity, but many other listeners will list to these recordings, accepting their technical imperfections since they are worth taking it too. This mode of interpreting Beethoven stems from a tradition, from an uninterrupted education that starting at Beethoven's time. Gise King's teacher grew up in this tradition, which wishes back to the 18th and 19th century, and Gise King himself transmitted it to us. To make you realize this, let us listen to the first major of the first movement, Allegro of the Opus 2, number 1. It is utterly brilliant, isn't it? A simple reading, posed, a technique that pulls out straight from the source. A very classical interpretation. However, Gissi King know how to keep his power on his extraordinary technical skills and we taught them until he lets run at the proper time. Let's listen to an extract of the Arietta Opus 111. It is all quite impressive. In the passage of the Arietta that we just listened to, the rhythm is based on the demi semi craver of which there are 12 per monsieur. In addition, we have 12 sixteenth notes which are played on the offbeat. It is quite a tough passage to perform at the real speed, while holding up a musical expressive phrasing. To sum it up, in some passages, Beethoven wants the song to be fortified for an entire note or musical chords. Gissi King's skills in all these difficulties confirm his Apollonian mastery of the tool. For Professor Fabre, whom you already know, 
Gis King is the Apollonian pianist. This definition, which refers to Apollo, is characterized by the order, the beat and serenity, as opposed to Dionysiac, which reflect an exuberant passion. Admittedly, vehemence is a characteristic feature of Beethoven, the man, and asserts itself also in his music. Nevertheless, Beethoven remains essentially a classical composer by virtue of his heritage. Therefore, Gissi King renounces to any kind of edgy emotion, but his manner of animating the musical phrases gives his performance uh, a real human action and dimension. It is full of nobility and distinction. Do enjoy listening to the Apollo of the piano, Walter Gissi King, who at the time of this recording had reached the summit of his art. We wish you a wonderful listening session.
Thank you.